Hey, where is everybody? I don't know. There's school today, right? I think so. It's really weird. Wait, no. Corona. Oh, right. Nice seeing you. With quarantine, it's been kind of hard, you know, thinking of things to do your whole day. Like, now that school's not around, you know, there's uh, not much that you can figure out to do. So, uh, here's a couple ideas that I have. Just go outside, get some sunlight, enjoy the day. Wow, would you look at that? Well, I think I've spent plenty of time outside. I'm gonna go back inside. A great way to spend your time during this quarantine is to play video games with your friends. Okay, okay, he's on me, he's on me. Oh, uh, yeah, he just got me. Don't worry about me, don't worry about me. Go for him. I think he's the last guy. He's right, he's right there under that thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you got this, you got this. Come on. What? Bro, that was so lucky. What? Are you serious? Staying connected with your friends and family through apps like FaceTime is a great way to check in with them and, you know, be social. Hey, also, what's up? It's been forever. How you doing? Dogs don't talk, do they? So these were three things to do during quarantine. I hope it gave you some ideas, and take care. What is Coca-Cola? Is it an excuse to get together? Since 1886, Coca-Cola has been passing on smiles from generation to generation. We've been giving kids scholarships, like the early birds and the all-nighters. And you get to enjoy what matters most. Coca-Cola. Drink up. Hi there, my name is Daniel and welcome to Daniel's Weekly Music Pick, where I just talk about music that I've been liking recently and hopefully it's something that you guys can check out while you're in quarantine. That's basically the whole premise of it. This week's highlight is, um, Mouseville, the, the whole series. So if you guys don't know what Mouseville is, which I'm pretty sure most of you don't, Mouseville is basically a series of compilation albums, mainly focusing on dead mouse material because, I mean, right there. And every single EP from one to three is really good. Now, I have this uh, Mouseville Level Complete box set, which I'm not encouraging you guys to buy. It's 60 bucks, and plus the EP is already available on streaming services, so yeah. And it includes every single level from level one to level three. However, this has a lot less tracks than what the streaming services have, which, I mean, I'm fine with, but I, I really wanted some tracks to be on here. <laughs> Mainly from level one, because there's a track that I really like from the digital version of this called Something Like, and it is a freaking bop. It's such a fun track to listen to. I'm, I'm still kind of bummed that it isn't on here, but I mean, Getter's, all, all Getter's always lost it here, so I'm fine with that. Still though, I highly encourage you to go to your digital music, music service and just go ahead and uh, listen to this. There's some really good stuff on here. There's some kinda handy ones, like if we go to the back again right here, um, there's some stuff like, uh, Nyquist, which is fine, but, eh, I don't really like it. And Glyphs is basically just 10.8, but just, eh, a little bit, like, I don't, I wanna say worse, but, like, it's a little bit more, like, laid back and chill. 10.8's everywhere, by the way, I really suggest you go check that out, cause that's insane. But Glyphs is, like, more of, like, a prototype of it, and I don't know why he decided to include it on the mouse little thing, but, whatever, it's fine. There are some duds, but overall, the, I mean, the series isn't that bad. Oh yeah, and the reason why I call it a compilation is because, like, I don't understand the people that call it like an actual album. This is more of a compilation and B-sides than an album, but 
and ever. And that is my music pick of the week. Hopefully you guys will check it out. You know, add a little bit of spice to your quarantine. And I'll tune to you guys next week. Bye.